I'm literally about to start filming in a bit. I just finished doing my hair and all that. And this is not what it's going to look like. Like, it's going to be curly. Yes, see what's that? Bad on. Hold up. Now, if you're asking, Margarita, are you eating a mango like an apple? Yes, I am eating a mango like it's an apple. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So nervous. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Margarita, and if you're not, hi, hello, and welcome back to my channel for today's video. I am reviewing slash, I don't know, maybe creating something with the Jeffree Star Jawbreaker collection. So right here, I have, right here, I have the Jawbreaker palette, the Mini Breaker, the Supreme Frost 2 lip products i have the lip velour and the lipstick or the lip ammo and yeah i'm gonna go ahead and open up these products the only things i have not swatched excuse me are these two eyeshadow palettes the rest i couldn't i i just had to swatch them so i swatched them i am gonna open up everything and i am gonna swatch everything as well let's go ahead and do lip products first so right here i have the liquid lipstick velour or the vel the velour liquid lipstick and this is in the shade strawberry crush <laughs> my brand and it's like a pinkish red super pretty super cute i'm gonna go ahead and swatch her just about right here i guess i get so excited each time like it's so pretty i freaking love it <gasps> i love the smell the next thing i have is the candy freeze lip ammo and this is what it looks like here and up when i first saw this i was like wow that is so tiny like i was really disappointed i was like yeah this lipstick this lipstick is big and then i opened it and i was like what that's it and i'm gonna go ahead and swatch it right next to it and this is candy freeze maybe question mark yep candy freeze go ahead and swatch next to it yes and it's like a pink pink iridescent glitter so freaking cute i love it and right here i have the diamond wet supreme frost <laughs> so this is what it looks like and ah, so pretty oh my gosh i love this so much look at how <laughs> yes and i'm gonna just go ahead and put it like right under here i really hope it shows through but ah, yet I really hope it's showing through <laughs> but if not wait until we put it on the face <laughs> okay so the next thing i'm gonna swatch is the mini breaker here before i get into the bigger jawbreaker now i did buy both of these palettes together and it was a whopping 75 dollars for both of them but i guess it's not that bad considering that the big palette is 58 and the smaller palette was like 28 i think or 24 i don't know but in here we have nine eyeshadows and I know that two of them, I believe it is Bubblegum and Purple Punch, I believe, are in the same palette. It's only those two shades. The other ones are only in this smaller palette. So right here, I'm going to go ahead and just um, swatch them and put them on my arm. First shade right here is called Double Scoop. Oh, that's actually really pretty. That actually had a really good amount of payoff. Next one is going to be Orange Crush. It does have like some gold reflex in there. Reflex. That's what Orange Crush looks like. Oh wow. That's actually really pretty. I'm getting like Orange Crush vibes to be honest. The next one right here is Foreplay. It's like a magenta lilac. Like lilac and magenta fused together. That's what it looks like. Ooh, is she pretty or whatever? I never do great on finger swatches, but for some reason, they look phenomenal right now. Alright guys, I had to change the position or whatever, and I was getting really tired of not knowing what I was filming, because I was filming it from the back camera, question mark, I think. Ooh. So, I'm going to go ahead and swatch the rest of the palette, and the next color here is Purple Punch. This one is a matte purple. That's what it looks like. Ooh, look at looks like I'm staining my eyelids purple. Next color here is called Slice, and this is kind of like a mustardy 
it's got like a very I don't know what type of texture it's very like I don't know but it's like a golden mustard that's the best I can describe this shade Ooh. yep it's a golden mustard next shade right here is called bubblegum and it is pink that's what bubblegum looks like go ahead and swatch it underneath not as like pigmented pigmented as like this purple right here but obviously that's just a finger swatch and everything is different when you swatch them than actually applying them next shade is bite me same thing it's got like that we like not weird but it's like got almost like a crumbly texture to it like very velvet vel vel velvety Ooh, this one's pretty Oh, hello. And then the last shade right here is called Hot Fudge. And this is a brown shade. So this is actually pretty good to have like a transition shade. Maybe to deepen it up. Hello, Hot Fudge coming through. Yes. So here are the nine shades from the mini jawbreaker. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and wipe this off and go into the bigger palette. Alright guys, time to go into the big jawbreaker palette here and... Oh. Oh! <laughs> Alright, so... Yes. Oh my gosh. Look at how beautiful this palette is. This is actually Jeffree Star's version of a colorful palette. So there are 24 shades in here. They vary from like... From mattes to like shimmers so right here is called virgin this first white shade is called virgin and right here we have a wow why does this look like powdered donut like I just ate a powdered donut what so here is the white shade it's not as white but I know that he did say this is kind of like an off-white or it's got like a yellowish white in it so the next shade is good morning it's a baby pink I live for baby pink so much here is Good Morning. It's almost the same as the white shade, but obviously it does have a tint to it. I'm not going to swatch um, Bubblegum just for the fact that I already did that. So I have Wow. That's my favorite word. I love that word. Wow. <laughs> and it happens to be the color yellow. Yellow, like, hello. I mean, wow. <laughs> Here's Wow. Go ahead and swatch. Wow! Underneath. Ooh, wow! <laughs> that is so pretty. I freaking love you, little shuttles. Next shade I have is Suck. I thought that said sick, but it says suck. I really hope this shade does not suck. So here is this orange. Oh, hi! Orange shade called Suck. Wow! This is almost like the same as the purple one from the mini breaker. The next color we have here is Liquor Rice. Licorice. Oh. <laughs> it's called licorice. You know what? For the rest of the video, it's called licorice. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch licorice. This one does feel a little bit harder. It feels like it is going to have some fallout. Go ahead and swatch it. <gasps> oh my gosh. Look at those colors. Ah! All right. So the next row that I'm swatching is the second row. Ooh. I'm going in or swatching cute. This is like a teal color. Look how cute she is. She's she pretty cool. Oh, wow. I mean, oh, cute. <laughs> and the next word on here is something that I don't say on my channel, but it's called. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch it. It's a coral, like a bright coral color. <gasps> this honestly gives me like Moana vibes. Hello? What? Next color here is this purple. It's called Gumdrop. And this is like more of like a lilac-ish purple. <laughs> I just want to <clears throat> put it on my lid. Yes! I'm feeling it. That is actually a really pretty a pastel combo. So the next shade right here is called Snack. And this is like a foil shade. Here is what Snack looks like. I'm gonna look like a whole snack if I put this shade on. Hello! Next color I have is Brain Freeze, which is a baby blue. Oh, so pretty. I really like this whole row. 
Oh my god, look at this little roll though. Row, row, roll, row, row, whole row. I can't English. And the last shade in the second row, it second row is called Jawbreaker. Honestly, I think this color would have been so freaking cool if it was like that, and then it had like all the different like little specks in it. Hello. Here is Jawbreaker. Ooh, hello. She cute though. It's almost like she has like an iridescent color. All right, so for the third row right here, the first shade is called And What? Question mark. Here's what the shade looks like. And what? What you gonna do about it? Next shade is called Orange Juice. Jugo de Naranja. What? Or Naranja de Jugo. No. Jugo de Naranja. Right here. Este color. Jugo de Naranja. Right here. Wow. This one's like really intense and fiery. That would be a really pretty combo. Next shade is called Sour, which is this green shade right here. And yes. Hello. Boom. Oh, this is such a pretty green. Ooh, I'm feeling that green. I actually really do want to dip into that green eyeshadow. <laughs> Next shade is called Soaked. So it is a royal indigo blue, pretty much. Freaking love colors so much. Oh my gosh. This palette is made for me. So the next shade right here is called Raspberry, and it is like a raspberry color. It is like a burgundy purple in here. Go ahead and ooh, hello. Wow. Oh my gosh. The last shade in the third row is called Cotton Candy. Now, if this almost looks like the lipstick, I don't, wow, that, I accidentally took off the whole star. Oops. Hey. Oh my god. So yeah, that is the pink. This is the whole th third row right here. For the last row right here, which is the fourth row, right here we have this yellow shade called Lemon Drop. Ooh, same thing. This one's like a crumbly thing. Maybe I shouldn't stop swirling these. Oh my gosh. But yeah, here is Lemon Drop. This is such a pretty yellow. Oh my god. <gasps> So the next shade right here is called Bite Me. I already swatched that, so I'm going to go ahead and skip over it. The next one is called Cherry Wet. And this one does have, like, the same texture as licorice. I mean, licorice. Mm -hmm. I don't know because if it's, like, the same color or, if, like, in the same color group or whatever. But it kind of, like, felt chalky. But I don't know. It could just be with the formula. Boy, she's so cute as... I have to edit that out. We love a good stainage. So the next shade right here is Tasty. It is another cool... Or it is another brown. So here's what Tasty looks like. Ooh, this is a nice brown. Next shade is called Cone. And this is kind of like a peachy-ish color. That's almost my skin tone color. And the last shade in this row is called Delicious. Navy blue color, and this is what it looks like, and this is what it looks like swatched. Ooh, that is so pretty. <gasps> Who's ready to get their eyelid stain? I am. All right, guys, so that is the end of the palette. You guys probably thought I was going to do, like, just an eyeshadow look. <laughs> no, we're going to go all extra, and I'm going to apply some latex. I am doing an eyeshadow look, but first we got to add some latex, so... Let's do this. All right, guys, so I'm going in with the liquid latex. This is from Walmart from, like, Halloween, so, yeah. She a little old. It's okay. I'm going to go ahead and just pour a little bit in here. I'm going to go ahead and take the back of a broken cosmetic or cosmetic brush. It's from Coastal Scent, and it was an angle brush, but I accidentally broke it, and it was my favorite freaking eyeliner brush. Now I'm going to go ahead and just kind of start to, like, sketch out what I want to do. I have to make sure I don't get any baby hairs in because the last time I did something like this, I got my baby hairs in. Okay, so before this dries down, I'm going to go ahead and grab some cotton and I'm going to go ahead and just kind of like start to take it apart and I'm going to apply it on top of the liquid latex. Alright guys, so I already put the cotton on here. I'm going to go ahead and put some more liquid latex on top of it. And I'm going to go ahead and start on the other process area that I want to do. Alright guys, so I'm going to go ahead and... 
gonna take some Cody Airspun and I'm gonna go ahead and put it all over here just so it's not as shiny. All right guys, I am back. I have my powder, my bronzer, my nose contour. Hello, Rhino Plessy. <laughs> but anyways, um, we're gonna go ahead and do the eyeshadow look, so we need to pop these up. Ow, 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 ow. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this white concealer from Morphe, and I'm gonna just go ahead and apply it onto my eyelid here, because I do want the pigments to pop out as best as it can. Instead of swiping it, I'm gonna go ahead and do a patting motion all over the eyelid here. So I'm gonna take a bit of Cody Airspun. I'm gonna go ahead and lightly pick up some product and put it on my eyelid, just so it has like that sticky, sticky base it's not too powdery but it's not too sticky i'm gonna go ahead and take this first shade called sour and i'm gonna go ahead and put this in my crease The next shade I am taking is going to be Bubblegum right here. And I'm going to go ahead and just apply this pretty much on top of the green. Next, I'm just going to go ahead and grab a fluffy brush and I'm going to go ahead and blend these two together. I'm going to go ahead and grab, wow, right here, this pink pink this is not pink this yellow shade and I'm gonna kind of run it a little bit with the pink and blend it out just taking a crease brush and I'm gonna go ahead and just put it in the inner corner with the yellow I'm gonna go ahead and pick up a little bit more of bubble gum and I'm just gonna swipe this over because we lost it a little bit and I'm gonna just go ahead and blend it out and you can see that the pink is marinating with the yellow a bit, and it's turning orange. Hello? Yes. Oh, I feel like we can't really see the colors that much. I'm going to go ahead and grab the same crease brush, and I'm going to pick up the same shade Sour, and I'm going to go ahead and just run it through, because I feel like I lost that color. And I'm going to just go ahead and blend this out as well. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and grab this white concealer again, put it on the back of my knuckle palm thing, question mark. And I'm going to go ahead and grab a flat brush, and I'm going to go ahead and do a half cut crease. I'm going to go ahead and pick up Sour again, and I'm going to go ahead and just kind of pat this on the outer corner, just so I can blend this in together. I'm going to go ahead and take the shade Virgin right here, and I'm going to go ahead and put it on top of this white concealer here. Okay, right, guys, so I brought you in closer because I feel like you guys couldn't really see that well. Like, I feel like you still can't even see what it looks like just for the fact that, like, now you can see it. Yeah, I feel like you can see it more. If I had, like, lighting, you could see it a lot more. But, yeah, that's what it looks like. And I'm going to go ahead and take this shade Jawbreaker right here, and I'm going to put that in the inner corner of my eye. I'm going to put a little bit of Lemon Drop in the inner corner right here, just on top. Yes, ma'am. Hello. All right, guys, we're not done yet. The next step is to add some gel liner. Yes, hello, but wait. We're not going to do a wing colorful liner. We're going to add the speck acai in the white. Let's do this. I'm going to go ahead and open up the pink one first. This is Boots, and I'm using the ColourPop Gel Shadows. And I'm going to just go ahead and just grab a little bit of this. And I'm going to go ahead and start making like little lines as, it, as if they're like little sprinkles. Next, I'm going to grab this shade orange, and it is in Puppy. And I'm going to just do the same thing. I have the blue one, and this is Prance. I'm going to go ahead and grab the yellow, and this is in Punch. I'm going to go ahead and grab red, and this is in Venus. And the last color, I'm going to go ahead and grab this green, and it is called Teaspoon. Hello, looks like we got sprinkles on our eyes. Hold on, got it. 
show you. Look at that. Look how cute that is. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. It looks like a little jailbreak. <laughs> That's the cutest thing ever. I'm gonna go ahead and do the other eye off camera, apply some eyelashes, and I'll be back. All right, guys, I am back. As you can see, I have the other eye on. I applied some white eyeliner. I did the lower lash line. I used bubble gum and wow, and it created this like orangey, smoky effect. Also applied some mascara and I applied some yellow eyeliner in the waterline. Hello, yes. Now we're going to go ahead and deal with this situation right here. Now if you guys only want to do the eye part, then by all means, just do the eye part. This right here, I was like, let's just go ahead and make like a little special effect thing because you know it's a little jawbreaker. I don't know, I'm just extra. But yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and grab some tweezers. And I'm just going to go ahead and gently just pull this. I don't want to pull it all off. I just want to pull like a little bit off to where it looks like it's skin coming up. You see that? That's what I want to go ahead and pull off. Alright guys, so pretty much what I am going to do on my eyelid, I'm actually going to be doing it right here and right here. So I'm just going to go ahead and like fast forward it. So. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and just grab this white shade Virgin again and I'm going to just go ahead and set it to make it white. So I'm actually going to be going in with these like Wet n Wild face palettes or paint palettes and I'm just going to go ahead and grab this little sponge here and I'm going to mix like this shade right here and maybe a bit of this one and I'm going to go ahead and put it on the edges right here. Okay, so I want to go ahead and apply this. Oh my gosh, I really like how everything's coming together. Ah! So I'm gonna go ahead and just grab this random brush or whatever. I'm gonna just go ahead and just tap in here and I'm gonna go ahead and apply it on here, on my cheeks. Hello, wet diamond who? Yes, I don't know if you guys, man, I'm just being dramatic with this because um, this is Jeffree Star's Supreme Frost and I really like it. Oh my god. Oh, hello, highlight, ooh. So I'm gonna quickly do my lips. I'm gonna go ahead and line my chola lips. Go ahead and apply some Strawberry Crush onto these lips. Ugh. Oh my gosh, I look <laughs> I look like a little candy worker place. I mean, that was the point though. Okay, it's dried down. Oops. I <laughs> got it. Time to apply some candy freeze. Oh my gosh, this Oh, this lip is so gorgeous. I just love glitter. <laughs> Alright guys, so yeah, this is the completed look of the Jawbreaker Summer Collection. I know I probably went a little bit overboard with this right here, but I was like, you know what? Let's do it. These eyelashes though, they are super gorgeous, super dramatic. I've never, I don't think I've ever really had some, excuse me, pestañas que eran así. I actually got them at Hot Topic for like $3 because they were on sale. And they're called Saucy Lashes. And this is in Wilshire. So I'm about to tag them on uh, Twitter or something like that. Y a ver que tal. Maybe they can uh, <laughs> send me some more. But um, yeah, I actually really like the look. Like, oh, hi. Yes, boom. Ooh. Yes. Jaw. Break up. Oh. <laughs> but yeah. 
So I really enjoyed playing with colors. I've always enjoyed playing with colors. I love colors so much. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed watching my little review slash, you know, um, testing out slash um, messing around with makeup. But yeah, I enjoyed the eyeshadow palette. I freaking love, love, love the Supreme Bra. Say hello. Hi. Wait. Hello. Hi. Yes. Hello. That's me. <laughs> But anyways, um, I really, really like the Velour Liquid Lipstick. It's very comfortable on the lips. The lipstick, of course, it's freaking comfortable. And hello? Yes. <laughs> but um, yeah, the eyeshadow palette, obviously phenomenal. I cannot wait to use it more. Um, I'm actually heading to the airport in the next like 45 minutes. So I have to <clears throat> pack my makeup and all that. And um, yeah, I am just... In awe, I freaking love it. I would recommend it. So by all means, if you love freaking colorful eyeshadow palettes, like I do, go ahead and get it. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Before you leave, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe. And since you're there, might as well hit the bell notification somewhere down here. And yeah, all right, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Yeah.